DJ Spinnem. Okay. So everyone can see you. Is this better? How y'all doing? All right, so first of all, we want to give a shout out uh, to the people, the fine folks who made this happen. Uh, speaking of CultureCon, shout out to Audible and to the fine folks at uh, Higher Ground Media for celebrating uh, the legacy and the canon of a genius. Um, definitely an uh, uh, honor to be a part of this process of bringing you uh, Stevie Wonder's importance to, to history. Give it, give it up for Stevie Wonder. Give it up for him. six decades of genius. Um, you know, there, there's been no authorized or unauthorized account of Stevie's life until now. So also shout out to uh, my native Philadelphia, Wesley Morris, for uh, putting those podcasts together. I hope you listen and support it, listen to the wonder of Stevie. Um, there's another person we have to give some love and respect to um, to help us celebrate this release. Um, someone who's early conversations with Stevie uh, and her uh, significant other, her husband, submitted their shared good taste. And um, I would like to introduce to you all my friend, Michelle Obama. <laughs> Stevie podcast, as Questlove said, is a deep dive into the genius of an amazing human being, Stevie Wonder. Um, not to be immodest, but it is one of the best podcasts you. that you will ever listen to. And I don't lie. Um, it's a good thing. And I want to thank uh, just a, a few people. Uh, the extraordinary group of individuals who brought this project to life. Um, our, our teams at Higher Ground, we got little mom up here with her phone. <laughs> but our entire team at Higher Ground Productions, Audible, our partner, we are so thrilled to be working with the Audible team. Um, our co-collaborator and executive producer, Chris yeah. yeah. He is also featured on the podcast, just telling us all about it. Um, just, you're so smart. Um, lost track of my stuff. Um, we have so many amazing, don't listen for that, but you know, we have some other interesting observations as well. But I have to be honest that the brilliance of the podcast is due in a large part to its host, Wesley Morris. Over the last couple of days, I heard the earlier edits, and I mean, Wesley, Wesley is he is the, the the second star of this podcast. He his his intelligence, his his humor, um, his enthusiasm. I mean, he will make you feel all of the feelings. Um, and I still remember the call that we made, Barack and I, uh, a couple of summers ago. On vacation, we were trying to get Wesley to agree to be a part of this project. And we had to beg this brother to do this, but I can say that after you listen to uh, the podcast, you will see that our efforts were well worth it. So I want to thank Wesley for just being an amazing host. Wonder's singular talent, uh, his vision, his greatness, um, and all that he means to folks like me, my husband, a generation of, of listeners. I mean, I, I still remember the experience that I had when I bought uh, Talking Book, which was the first album that I ever bought with my own money. Um, and listening 
came to it at my uh, grandfather Southside's house, who was a music official. Southside, yes, <laughs> that was his name to us. But he loved music. He loved jazz, um, and he didn't always like our music, but he loved Stevie. So I knew it was good music because. He allowed me to play it on his loud, record loud. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he let us use his stuff to listen to yeah. Stevie. <laughs> and we can be connected, we can be better to one another through love and, and music and all of that. So that's, he's the originator of hope. Yeah. 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 And we had the pleasure of doing a little FaceTime with Stevie before we came on board, uh, came out here tonight. Uh, he is a beautiful spirit, but he is truly a genius. Yeah. And the fact that he is still alive when we can give him his flowers. Amen. Yeah. And, and the fact that this is one of the few wholesome documentaries of his life and career, so that's also saying something a little fishy. Yeah. Uh, yes. You know, yes. I mean, why has it taken so Amen. long to Amen. really yes. break down Amen. this man's track worker? Yeah. I mean, Pretty five fun. amazing albums in five short years. I mean, he was just spitting out hits after hit after hit. Yeah. Um, He's still alive. And he's still alive and yes. still doing it. Still, yes. to yes. still going on tour. Yes. Yes. He's about to go on tour because this is a time in our nation's history where Stevie does not want to sit on the sidelines and let it just happen. He gets up and he shows up and he's doing that right now. So we owe him these flowers. I want you to share it with everybody you know. Oh, and another thing, while we're talking about spirituality and purpose, I want y'all to vote. Yeah. 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 As you're, you're listening to Stevie and you understand that a lot of what he was fighting against, we are still fighting against. Every day. And that music is about change, culture is about change, it's not just about a bunch of likes, it's about moving people to something better. And you all have the responsibility, just as Stevie did, to use your platforms for something really big. Yes. This is one thing, but there's something bigger coming up in a few weeks. Yes. And I, I hope that you all are all focused in the next couple of weeks because it will absolutely matter. So with that, I will turn it back over to my brother. Obama, it was so nice to see you tonight.